Happy Thursday, crafty friends. Hello, everybody. I'm coming on today for hashtag Twenty Thursday, hosted by Janet Kay. And I am using Sandy from Decorate Your Life's My Little Princess collection because I printed one of the pages out and it made them the perfect size. I printed it out on index card and it made them the perfect size for a twinchy. And then I had some scraps, so I'll show you what I'm doing. All right, so these were scraps, so I thought, you know, I had I had a piece of paper, two pieces actually, that would be um, perfect for a two by two. So there's that's where I started. Okay, and then these little images, you know, are almost like a one by one. And so I'm gonna I'm gonna layer them up like this. I love this coral looking. Um, glitter cardstock so then i'm going to put this on there and this on there and then one of these bows on each one Isn't that sweet so i'm going to assemble these in a snap these things are so much fun before this challenge i had not i had not done any of these i don't think bestie's still done any have you well yeah, because they're so much fun, and you can use the littlest pieces of stuff that you have, and yeah. and just make beautiful things, and um, you know, and then you've got the perfect thing for to embellish anything: a card, a memory deck, even an ATC. You know, I mean, it's a it's a win all the way around. It's a money savings win. It's a craft savings. It's a it's a stash builder. It's everything. Yes. I, mean, it's a stash I like a stash builder. I do too. I do too. And you know, I'm doing every every hashtag that's an open collab that I think that I see. You know that I can because yes. you know Patty and Bonnie have one that's ATC MDC, and I'm having so much fun with that. And then Anna has a one. Each month, that's a different theme, and um, Mary Ann and Gigi have uh, an embellishment with it, embellish with us Wednesday, and you know it's so good. And then I have a little box, and it's got all these fun things that I've made. And then I'm like, oh, well, I can use that for this, and boom, it's done. So it's a really good thing. It is. Yeah, she's coming to sing it again Friday. Oh, Lordy, yeah. mercy, y'all. Okay, so I need y'all, I need some prayers because uh, the, the, the inspector went today to inspect my mom's house for the loan. We got an offer the first day and, um, yeah, and, um, y'all just, Please pray that everything will go as as God's plan. What whatever, yeah. whatever. I, you know, I know His plans being followed. So, but uh, we have we went from um being completely overwhelmed, yeah, and and having so much to do, to you know. Then finally getting the house on the market and then getting an offer and and now we're trying to get everything out of the house and you know and sell it and make money for her care and you know it's been a whirlwind and uh I mean it's been stressful but you know I have to say Bessie's been by my side uh, my brother has been there. yep been there. Done that. If y'all ever need anything securely wrapped so it won't get broken or something shredded, Bestie's your girl. I don't know if I I don't know if I'll loan her out though. I'm kinda I'm kinda partial to her, you know. <laughs> hmm. Yeah. 
yeah. So anyway, this weekend we're having a sale, and um, um, we're gonna try to sell what we can, and provided that the inspection goes okay, and there's no, you know, unforeseen surprises with anything, um, it'll close on the 18th of May. Wow. They're, they're pre-approved and and ready to go. Wow. Yeah, and um, they've apparently been looking for a year, and oh, okay. yeah, and when they I saw this that. house, they were just like, "This is it." So, um, well, I mean, they came from Nashville. Uh huh. Oh. Yep, and they they offered us more than what we asked for, which we thought what we asked for was fair, and uh, <laughs> it's just been. A blessing so far, you know, all the way around. I mean, there, and not that there has been not been hard work involved, because there has, but um. Pussy, he worked like a dog. <laughs> I can do some work now, people. I can do some work. He is a, he is a worker. Yep. He's if I know man. something needs to be done, I can get after it. You know. She gonna come to big name. I got lots to be doing. Yep. That's right. I promised Bestie. I said we'll be. We'll be taking care of yours next. Only not so that she can be moved out. <laughs> she's wanting she's want to have your tail make some graph money. <laughs> Y'all know how that is. When I saw the money you made, I was like, mm-hmm. But you know what? Hayden jumped in on that. Hayden said, if I bring some toys over here, I don't want Can I sell them and keep the money? <laughs> well. Of course. Yeah. We know all kids have too many toys. Oh, yeah. Or, I won't say all kids, but our kids do. I'll say that because. When I would go see my mom and grandpa, this is what I had to play with a deck of cards, a deck of dice, and a adding machine, and I could watch a couple of. And when I went to my grandparents, we had, it was called the playroom, although it actually wasn't a playroom. It just had a tin, which I have now, that had crayons in it, that it, that used, that was originally a tin for, um, hard candy. No. It had some coloring books, and it had some, I mean, some, you know, really inexpensive toys, and not much of that. And a chair, a turquoise blue chair that spins around. Okay, it's like a, a bar stool chair. And so that chair. Oh, that be, it's over there now. Yeah, is at my mom and dad's right now. And um, when we were there last weekend, my brother was sitting in it while he was going through daddy's tools and stuff. And I told, I was telling Bessie, I said, you know, I'd spin around in that thing till I was couldn't stand up straight. <laughs> that was my entertainment, you know. Other yeah. than we played outside and we watered the flowers and we talked. Yeah. And my granddaddy made us, he'd cover the kitchen table up with a um, blanket and we'd get, he'd climb under there with us and we'd, you know, be in a fort and he would tell us stories and there was a big swing out in the yard and, you know. My grandmother would push well, me in, into piles of cow poop. <laughs> and laugh and run. <laughs> I think I think I might have inherited some of her little deviousness. Oh, talk to him for just a minute, Bestie, and let me go get a, that picture of her. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Talk to him for just a second. All right. Well, she is coming Friday morning, and I have to be out of the bed. Um, because you know what, if I'm not, she'll keep me out of that bed, and, uh, then we will head out to her mama's house, and start dragging everything out for the yard sale on Saturday, there's an issue, though, we do need prayer about that, I think it's 70% chance of rain, uh. so we don't, we don't need rain. No, okay, I'm back. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I'm just saying, we 
need some prayers out there for no rain. Yeah. Okay, so I, I've told y'all that um, my granddaddy owned a photography shop, and my grandmother colorized the pictures. And so yeah. this is a print that he took of her, and you can see around these outside edges where she colorized. And, of course, you know, her lips and her cheeks and her corsage here. I have those earrings, by the way. And um, look at her. She was. Yeah, she was. You can tell she's feisty. She was a tiny little bitty thing, a little bitty whip of a thing, and she would always leave the kitchen cupboards open. And she was so little, she could walk under them, and they wouldn't hit her head. And I would walk into them, and oh my goodness! And she would say, "Brain yourself, didn't you?" <laughs> and then she'd just laugh. She was a mess. I Brain, love her. Yeah. Brain, yeah. Her name is Gertrude. Not Gertrude. Gertrude. Oh, Gertrude. Yeah. Well, mm -hmm. she was called Gertie, wasn't she? Gertie. Yep, sure was. So, anyway, there's my sweet mama. And, um, so, anyway, okay, back to this. So, here's my Twinchies, y'all. I did it while we were yakking. And, um, and I have lots of other, uh, I did a video of some things that I have got from my mom and dad's and that came from my grandparents, and I've got some more, so I will be doing another video. Uh, his, I'll take you down the history lane of um, some pretty cool stuff. So, anyway, y'all follow Janet's hashtag, make you some Twinchies. You know, you could put this in the middle of the card and say, Happy birthday, congratulations, thank you. Well, you know, it's done. So, anyway, I will leave Janet's... Um, Link in the description box below, and y'all check her out, and make some Twinchies with us. Hashtag Twinchy Thursday. All right. Love you guys. Blessings. Hello.